I, I just don't know how... I just don't know how any log flume got constructed in this weather. I don't know how they didn't just look at it and go, what's the point when you can get this wet for free? Hello, T. Hello. We're on our way to the best place on Earth, Blackpool. What are you excited about most? Uh, well, we're going to the Pleasure Beach. Yeah. And Rhiannon doesn't like rides. No. So, that, it's just going to be an hour of screaming. Ah! <laughs> Hi there! Rhiannon has changed slightly since, uh, since, uh, since our last video. Yeah, I've lost weight and I've grown a beard. <laughs> we're with Theme Park Nomads. It's our first crossover video. Crossover vid, vlog on vlog fam. That sounds like a porn genre. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you can go. Here's a little tip for you. If you're going to come to Blackpool Pleasure Beach, make sure you park just outside of the, uh, the, the, the big Pleasure one. Beach so that you can, yeah, so you can make sure that no one fucking touches your stuff <laughs> whilst you're in the park. <laughs> so Noah's Ark used to be a ride and uh, you can see why it's not anymore because it would have been shit. So um, we've been in Blackpool for about an hour or so and I'm sweaty, <laughs> not keen. I know this isn't what you meant to use a GoPro for, being a fat mess, but I am who I am. Uh, Blackpool Pleasure Beach is run on Victorian machinery and possibly child labour. It's a funny looking child. <laughs> oh, well they are in Blackpool. <laughs> this is very disappointing, I've just been told that I'm fat enough that I may require my own carriage on the roller coaster. <laughs> That's a sad day in anyone's life. Right, why is it that I'm getting fat shamed on one roller coaster and then on another one I'm being fired out of a giant Pepsi Max can? I'm getting conflicting, uh, getting conflicting messages here, Blackpool, Pleasure Beach. Well, it's just saying, you know, a bit of it is a bit of fun, but don't add too much. This here is Europe's biggest Burger King, as I've just been told off camera. And like, why why do you need to have it in the middle of a place where everything's telling me that I'm too fat to get on any of the rides? No. Um, so this is uh, this is the Laughing Man. I think he's uh, been to some of my gigs, and that's why you stopped. Um, so. Once again, I know this isn't how you meant to use a GoPro, but this is me in the queue for a fish and chips. Yeah, this is, this is the interesting bit, me. Ooh, there's suspense. Will I get fish? Will I get chips? Will I get both? I've just bought fish and chips, yeah. and uh, I've seen what colour the sea is round here, so I just hope that this isn't from anywhere near here. Like, what's the point in having like a wet ride, like a log flume in Blackpool, where it's always just pissing down? Yeah, this is like a tunnel of love kind of thing. If, you know, there's Black a tunnel of love in Blackpool. Tunnel of love. Blackpool, is, this is a fact, is the the STD capital of Europe, so I don't think I want anything to do with a tunnel of love <laughs> in this city. The sign up there that says that we're going to be travelling to the Blue Grotto, which I imagine is just going to my uncle's in the 70s. Little fact about the pyramids, those are not them. Stalactites? Yeah, and stalagmites. Stop shoving off. Well, I know Prince Andrew won't become one ever now. Yeah. Why don't you see what this monkey's doing? What's that monkey doing there? Oh! <laughs> um, that is exactly what you should do with a rebound. 
hit them in the balls. Uh, so we're going on Alice in Wonderland, which I think is uh, inspired by not only his novel, but his uh, crippling drug habit. Opium. Yes. They remind me of people I went to school with. Someone with diabetes, I think, died in the maze and has left us clues on the way to his corpse. Right, first of all, how Chinese is a litter bin. Secondly, the, the absolute scruff who left their Pepsi bottle down there. <laughs> Could you have not hung on to it for another moment? Do you see how easy that was? Fucking do it yourself next time. Don't leave it in the Chinese maze. Like, why is it a Chinese maze? Like, all I'm doing is walking round and round in circles. Is it just that I do that until I become communist? Light, but, you know, something in the maze. And it's, it's not just, I'm talking, not talking about light in terms of Tom's jacket. I just don't know how Chinese this maze is. It's not. What I'm, like, I'm sure they've just put these rides over it because they want people to go, to look down into the maze and go, look at the state of them, just walking past the bins. This is, I was right, this is the beginning again. <laughs> We're back at the start. Why have it come to a gulag? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I'm learning from this? This is one of the few things I was excited about doing today. Never Be get your hopes up for anything nice. Really fancy taking in the uh, the atmosphere. I have a bench here. Right, so this is obviously part of the Chinese puzzle maze, otherwise I wouldn't have this. But why have this be the end? Look at the state of that box! <coughs> that was pretty good. Um, quite. Makes you feel a bit scared. Which. In all fairness, in all fairness, I can get that same experience when someone wishes to knife me over my donuts. Um, one other thing that I don't understand, right? So they're making you wear these face masks. Why? When you go in at, you know, 100 miles an hour through the air. Secondly, they then want to sell you a picture. Oh yeah, that's me, 1172. The one who looks like an ill surgeon. Apparently in the shop, this uh, this scented candles that are like themed on the rides, and I think the bigger the ride, the more it smells of shit. Where are we going? Yeah. Why? Why does it say hot dog on the side of this? Who's looking at this and going? Pray tell what what delicacy is that person eating? Looks a bit like the Hogwarts Express. Except if Harry sold weed to the rest of the kids. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely feeling like if this is the state of things, they definitely should renationalise the railways. Quite busy. It is Monday. I feel like Ben's like summing some stuff up, so I feel like I should probably do that as well. Let's see if we can get a wet. Yes! I don't 
don't think I like this amount of enthusiasm. <laughs> it's, it's not for me. I mean, bear in mind this is only a three mile per hour train. I think I can safely say no one's ever died on the train. Oh, Tom, I could go on this all day. Well, let's not. Because it's not exactly a ride, is it? It's a sit down that travels. So this is the ghost train. This is the one I've got the most amount of nostalgia for. Um, which makes me worried because whenever I get nostalgic from my childhood, I either end up leaving horrified or disappointed or both. That bit up there is like a representation of my career. Just all sad, and even the happy one looks a bit odd. Uh, just been on the Big Dipper. Right. I wouldn't mind, it's actually right. one of my favourite woodies right. in the look park. At, look at how um, fucked yeah, this is. Me in, in roller coaster form. Look at how, look at how fucked it is. Yeah? Honestly, you've got bits of moths on the side of the wooden tracks. How's that not a lawsuit? Ridiculous. So this one's the Grand National? Yeah, so presumably midway through you see a horse fall over and then at the end of the ride you see, uh, you see just a big bucket of glue. So have you liked your day at the Pleasure Beach? Yeah, it was good. But I just, yeah. Awesome day. Do you ever feel like you can have too much fun? Only if you're old and depressed. Well, chalk me up as old and depressed now. <laughs> Banter. No. So, uh, how did you find the, the crossover vid? A very good crossover video. It's good to see our different, how I say it, styles. Um, um, I swear a lot more than Ben. That's that's the difference. Yeah, really. I'm sort of like um like a theme park Santa, and you're sort of like um theme park Grinch. A theme park Grinch. <laughs> Tom Tom the theme park Grinch. He's a mean one. <laughs> theme park Grinch. He'll take the screws out of your roller coaster. You'll be falling to your death. <laughs> I don't like the fact that you've put this to a tune. Sorry, mate. It's just, it was it just. It was pleasurable. It wasn't a beach. Um, it's right next to a beach, though. Loads of things are next to things. <laughs> that, that doesn't make them then those things that they're next to. You can't by osmosis become a beach, because otherwise old men would just and old women would just be known as beaches after several years of retirement. Right. This is the, the Derby Day. Um, we've just heard that there's pipe organ music, which I think, I think this is going to be the scariest ride we've been on. 